guys, Nick here with Texas Best Used Motorcycles in Mansfield, Texas. I've got a really cool bike with me today. It's a 1970 Triumph Custom Bobber. This thing is badass, guys. It's got an olive drab green paint job, and the paint actually looks pretty fresh. Looks pretty well done. It's got a small couple of chips right here in the paint on the tank. I mean, it's a 45-year-old bike. So you got some little staining here on the engine cases, a little bit of surface rust on that old tank. But other than that, man, this thing is really, really, really clean. So I think the coolest thing about this bike is the jockey shift. This isn't really typical to the motorcycles you're probably thinking of. The rear brake is actually on the left side. The shifter is on the right side, so it's kind of backwards. But that's how these bikes work. This one doesn't have front brakes at all, guys. That's all you got is the rear brakes down here. But it's not hard to ride. Still got your clutch up here and your throttle. And basically how you ride it is you got your clutch hand right here. And when you want to shift, you just pull in the clutch. It's a four speed. So that's going to be first and then second, third, fourth. Really nothing to it. I think it's a 650cc motor. It's a parallel twin. It's got dual carburetors on it. I think those are... I think those are Makuni carbs. It's got some nice little filters on it with the chrome plates. They also put the olive drab green on the cylinders here. Kind of got the spade little timing cover. It looks pretty cool. It's got, also got a small mark right here on this fork. It's got a Springer front end. That thing is sick looking. It's got the skinny front tire chrome wire wheel with the black lip the headlight sits nice and high it's got drag style handlebars it's got a real cool look to it it's got mid controls on it and it's also got a sprung seat it's not a big seat i'm a big guy so i need a little more surface area for my rear end if you're a bigger guy you might want to put a bigger pad on there but it's still very usable it's got the battery mounted here in the back. There's your ignition. It's a kickstart only, guys. No electric start, but it's real easy. Dual carb, so it's got a pet cock for each one. All you gotta do is turn on the gas, and then you got these little choke levers here. Pop those down. And man, I, I can get this thing to start first kick, no problem. It is a bargain bike special, so we're keeping them in a separate area from our frontline bikes. We make good deals on them so we can pass the savings on to you. We sell them as is, test ride them, get them cleaned up, make sure they pass the Texas State inspection, and we put them out for sale. So I'm going to go ahead and set down the camera here, see if I can get it fired up. I really like the pipes too, it's got these shorty pipes, kind of come down right here by the battery. It's a chain driven bike, you can change the sprockets. Get it kind of geared how you like but you know what that 650 with the four speed plenty of power i mean this bike doesn't weigh next to nothing i mean so i'm gonna go ahead and try to kick it over here Simple as that guys, first kick, no problems. Now I'm gonna tell you, this is a rigid frame bike, it has no rear suspension. 
So it is it is a kind of a rough ride. It's a stiff ride. But this is a cool bike just to hang around, maybe go down some city streets, hit some bike shows. I like it a lot, man. If y'all like to know more about it, you can contact our sales team toll free at 817-985-8888 or you can check out our website at texasbestusedmotorcycles.com and see our full inventory. We offer excellent finance and extended warranty options. Take almost anything in on trade and we sell and ship bikes all around the world. So it'll be real easy to get this one to you. This is Nick with Texas Best Used Motorcycles in Gainesville, Texas. Thanks for watching.